Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel. It is fall, September in fact, and it is football season. So we are huge football fans, Green Bay Packers fans, go Packers. Woo. And as such, we are making some chili and we're gonna make spinach and artichoke dip, re getting ready for the game. So uh, we're gonna get started here. chili recipe for a while now and I don't exactly remember where I got the recipe from and I also don't really know measurements for things so that's not terribly helpful but um, you can just kind of eye eyeball things as you go but first we're gonna throw in into our crock pot here the ground beef um, obviously if you'd rather use ground turkey or chicken that's cool too this isn't on by the way yeah this is not on. <laughs> we will yeah, plug it in it will be yeah okay all right, so there goes the meat. So ground meat, we're adding first ground beef. Um, then we are gonna add cocoa, a can of these cannellini beans. Dump them in. And I don't drain beans. I like all the liquid to go into. So we have that. Um, then kale, do you wanna add, we have a can of some red kidney beans here. Oh, careful, dump it right in, buddy. All the way. Dump it all in. And again, not draining the liquid. Keep dumping. Turn it all over. Mom, there you go. Oh. Cocoa tail baby. That's all right. Okay. Cocoa, just let him do it. Good. Good, good job. Ooh, good job, bud. All right. And then... I'll take that. that. Okay. Um, then we will do some diced tomatoes here. A can of that. I want to do that. Okay. Do you want to do tomatoes? Mm -hmm. Okay. Dump them right in. Got it? And all the juices again. Good. Oh, there's a few more left. Can I get them? Can I do that some next? Okay. Um, then we are gonna do some green pepper. It was a Let big green pepper. It. I probably only used like half of it, but obviously whatever you like is good. Ooh, good job. Get it all in there. Nice. Okay, great job. That's all right. Good work. That's okay. And then um, in here, I have some diced onion and celery. Um, do you want to do that? Celery, I know it's kind of different for chili maybe. Honestly, one day at the grocery yeah. store, I was buying diced onion because I didn't want to chop it. I hate chopping onions. And they didn't have any just plain onion. It was celery and onion. So I used that and I liked it. And so now I just always put celery in my chili. Um, okay, and then we're going to do a can of tomato paste. Okay, you got it. Scoop it in there. I'll hold this and you just scoop it in. Just pull it right out. Yep, shake, shake. <laughs> sort of. Here, you know what? I'm going to do this a little just because I think it's going to all mash on the side otherwise. So, put that in there. Hey, he did all of it. Oh, I'm going to need a new spoon for garlic, I think. And the dogs are a little upset back there. I want something. Um, Guess I could smell it. They want to eat or they want to go outside, maybe. Okay, I'll give you that one, thanks. Okay, who wants to add um, no, no, no. Okay. Me, me. salt? So salt, again, I, I just do it to taste. So we're gonna add that for now and I'll probably end up adding more. Um, but I'd rather be able to add some and not no. it be too salty. Um, then of course, chili powder. Okay, but we have to be a little careful with it. So you can do some chili powder. And unfortunately, again, I'm eyeballing things all these. I don't I'm measure, doing which is not this. great. I'm uh, doing this now. But I'm sure you can find recipes and get, a feel. Mm -hmm. and get a feel for how much you need. No. And again, you can always add more later. So we'll start with that. Kale has, what do you have here, buddy? You have parsley flakes. You know what? That does not have the... A little lid on it so I'm gonna help you with that because otherwise that's gonna just dump the whole thing in just just a little bit and dried parsley shake 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 Ooh, Ooh, that's yeah. good that's good. Here. That good. good job Thank you. that's the way a bit that was a little bit yummy okay <laughs> dried oregano leaves again mm -hmm. we're missing the top for whatever reason but here, Coke. we'll let Coco do that one, but it's stuck in the cab. That's okay. All right, I'll do this one. How about that? Okay, a little bit of that. 
And just wait on that, honey. And then the basil. Here, Coco, you can do some basil. Shake that in. You can do some garlic. Okay, good. Give it one more shake. Okay, great. All right. Healthy. That was plenty. Healthy dose of basil there. Garlic. You can never have enough garlic. Nice scoop. I love garlic and everything, so. You might be able to have enough. Go ahead and scoop. <laughs> Kale will show you what, Ooh, what it's like to too much. Yeah. That's great, Kale. Good job. Um, I'm actually going to add even a little bit more. You are going to add some pepper for us. Papa, I'll add something too. I know, you just added garlic. I'm going to need help mixing. Do you think you can help me with that? Okay, so pepper. I mix two. Again, however much you think. I want to mix. We'll start with that. Add some more later if we need to. Yeah. And then, oh, that was nice. Kale's going to start our mixing. Yeah. Ah. That's what that looks like all in there right now. I have an idea. Let me start it. I always and be silly. You are silly. Mama, I always be silly. You're always so silly. <laughs> I brought some that though. That was silly. Yeah, one second, one second. Okay, let me get yeah. let me just try to get it a little bit mixed in. And then you have to be really careful when you mix it so that it doesn't splash out like that, okay? <laughs> Can you be careful? I know. It doesn't want to look. It doesn't That's all right. My turn. Okay. You go ahead and give it a little bit. Then we're going next. I'm going next. Okay. We're going to mix that all up. And then um, we will obviously go plug that in and leave it on low for, I don't know, I usually do like around six hours. And we actually prefer our chili. We found like whenever we have leftover chili, it always tastes a little bit better than when you first eat it. So we're making this today to eat tomorrow so that it can really like simmer and set in and all the, all the flavors yes, yep. can mix in together. So mm -hmm. we are gonna do that. So we might leave it in the crock pot for even a little bit longer than that. Um, and I think that is everything great. for the chili. So this looks great. <laughs> this looks great. Are you gonna eat it? When it's done? No. You're not. How come? I don't like it. Yeah. <laughs> He's lying. Okay. okay. Oh, well, we'll see. All right. That is the chili. So now we can move on to finish an artichoke dip. Today we are going to make our spinach artichoke dip. So we're going to start with a full block of cream cheese. So I'm going to put this whole thing in, and then I'm going to add just like a little bit more. This was five ounces, I believe, five right? Ounce. Yeah, so I'm going to add a little bit from this one, too, because I usually add a little bit more than that. And it wilts down a lot. Um, that's probably good. Then, yeah, you want to throw the artichoke carts in. So that's just a can that I chopped up. In she goes. Good. Garlic. Again, I'm going to add a healthy spoonful of that. So I'd say, eh, I'd probably use like a tablespoon and a half. Ooh. 
Smell that? Mm -hmm. I love it. I love it, love it. Okay. And then this cheese works really well. I don't know if you can see. It's uh, mozzarella and parmesan. Um, and it's the perfect amount. So I just dump in the whole bag. Okay. Easy peasy. Good. And then some salt and pepper. So I don't want to over salt this because that can be a little. Can always add salt. Overwhelming. Can't take it away. Yes. You, <laughs> you're not very good at that. <laughs> and then some pepper. And we'll go plug that in on. So that's kind of where it is now. Low for about. Yeah, really only takes like two three hours. Coco's gonna give her a taste test. Mm. What do you think? Thumbs up. <laughs> Good? All right. Ooh, two thumbs up, guys. Two thumbs up. I guess that's your bowl now and not mine. <laughs> Alright guys, that is it for today's video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Hopefully you try making one of these sometime. It's super easy. Um, crock pots are like my favorite thing ever. You just dump everything in and let it go. And they are both very, very tasty. So Delicious. try them out sometime and let me know if you do. Uh, other than that, don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. And uh, thanks for joining us. Yes, we will see you soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.